just going out there doing what I got to do because I know my time winding down. Uh, yeah, just giving all I got. I know Mike and Seth, they've been really giving us their best they, uh, the uh, remainder of the season. I've been lacking a little bit, so I feel I had to step up a lot. And I'm bringing that greediness on the defensive end and offensive end uh, the rest of the way. It wasn't really that tough. It's just getting our minds back right. Uh, uh, one game at a time, you know, preparing. Uh, but yeah, we got another game Saturday, so we got to let this one go. Work hard again tomorrow, and then get going on Saturday. Our maturity, and I feel like we came out the same way we did when we was there in the first eight minutes. I feel like if we would have came out like we did at the last uh, part of the first half and not carried over going down backwards uh, in the second half, then we would have had a good game. But we just got to keep that momentum that we had the remainder of the first half and just keep that going. We got to mature more because we know who we have and who we got, and we got to depend on everybody to step up and do what they got to do. Like we did every other game, let it go, get back to work the next day, clear our mind, learn from what we did wrong, and find ways to get better at it. And like I said, just keep our head high. We got to just keep grinding, do what we got to do to uh, find out what we got to do to win. I mean, that would be great for us, getting our bodies rested, uh, us getting in the gym, working on the things like we do in film to get better at freshening our bodies. Like I said, uh, yeah, the week would be great for us. <laughs> Assume the shot would be missing. Go get it. <laughs> yeah, appreciate it. Yeah, you know, I thought I thought Kent State looked terrific. Uh, you know, they hadn't played since last Friday. Uh, they looked fresh. We did not. Uh, you know, they they looked like they're on roller skates out there, and, and uh, really raced up and down the court well. And uh, I thought their pressure bothered us. Uh, you know, on the perimeter, took us out of a lot of offense. We wanted to run, um, and so we were forced to really, uh, you know, kind of spread out the court and drive the ball. And um, when we did miss shots, they turned it into points in a hurry. We lost Peterson a, a lot early. Um, he hadn't been shooting the ball near as well as he as he shot it tonight. Um, but we allowed him to play horse uh, out there tonight uh, with some of the shots uh, that uh, that he took. We lost him in transition at times. Um, and then Jalen Walker is, you know, even when we, you know, when we took the lead, uh, you know, there Jalen Walker is kind of the difference maker. You know, he's he's the X factor, and when all else fails, you know, they can just get him the ball, and he's one of those guys that's capable. Uh, similar to Thomas Wilder, the way we had last year, he's similar. One of those guys that can just go get himself uh, a quality shot. Well, it's not ideal. Um, you know, it's certainly, uh, you know, there's. No excuses. I mean, Kent State beat us. You know, they just beat us. Um, but we're we're tired. You know, and so uh, we're in the middle of this Saturday, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday uh, uh, week here, and and so it's um, you know we I, I thought we had pretty good energy. Kent State punched us in the mouth early. We punched back. You know, had a, had ourselves a ball game, had ourselves a heck of a ball game. Really could showed a lot of fight, but I thought we ran out of gas, you know, in the uh, in the second half. And and uh, they didn't, you know, so um, it was. It was quick turnaround. It helped. It helped that we had played Kent one other time before. Our guys were at least familiar with their personnel. Um, the thing that the thing now getting ready for Miami, that's going to be a whole different story um, because they've had time off also. We only have one, we're really a day and a half now uh, to kind of prepare for the game. So a uh, quick turnaround. Really important. I mean, you know, we had some guys obviously not play as well as, as they had been playing tonight. And, and a lot of that had to do with Kent State's defense. You know, um, but Josh, you know, Josh really is, he's staying out of foul trouble, you know, and foul trouble's kind of plagued him on and off. Uh, throughout the year, and uh, he wanted the challenge of guarding uh, Jalen Walker at times, and we were able to help set that up. Um, and I thought he did a nice job there, and I thought that that really got him into a flow. It got him, he was he was competitive, you know, and and uh, that also helped him and with his offense. He was very active, obviously, on the glass, you know, a couple of dunks there, and um, uh, that we're going to need it. You know, we're going to need it as we continue on in the last half of the season here. We're going to need all of our guys um, to uh, uh, to play well. So it was great to see Josh play well. No, I, again, you know, when we're – they, I mean, Kent State, what Kent State did a lot of is, you know, really hard-hedged a lot of ball screens. And, and uh, they were very fresh in doing so. I thought we were kind of uh, – uh, I don't want to call it lazy. Um, we just couldn't turn the corner on them. 
uh, you know, when we, in our ball screen offense, we run a lot of pick and roll offense and uh, we couldn't roll, we couldn't get, we couldn't turn the corner on them. So we kind of had to spread it out and, and not use as many ball screens and just try and drive it. You know, and th that, that took a lot of effort. Uh, took a, I mean, it, it took its toll on us. We tried to get the ball into Seth. You know, Seth didn't have one of his better shooting nights tonight. Uh, he's, he's pretty disappointed right now. But, um, you know, he can't play the way he's been playing every single night. You know, and there's a lot of guys, um, you know, that would still love to pull down 12 and, you know, pull up numbers of 12 and 7 on a night, on an off night. You know, but, um, you know, I thought, I thought Kent did a good job of, of putting somebody, you know, really – really being physical with him down below uh, and then having somebody behind him. And then when we did get the ball to him, you know, he just he wasn't able to convert as much as he would like. So they didn't really have to worry as much about inside, outside. You know, they just really uh, extended their defense. And like I said, when we ran our ball screen stuff, um, our guards struggled with their length. Uh, you know, Whittington uh, coming out there, Frederick coming out there. Um, you know, really bouncing Mike out uh, and, and making the longer passes. We weren't able to make as many short passes and play downhill unless we weren't using ball screens. Well, um, Nike Sabande, uh, I mean, uh, he's, he's a terrific player. I mean, we, I haven't studied them, um, but I, I've watched him a couple of times, obviously preparing, like, well, for this game, uh, for instance. Um, you know, Miami played him not too long ago, a week ago or so, and lost by – lost by three and uh, you know when I watch Miami uh, play I, I I don't know how they're losing games um, because they're as talented as 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 anybody um, they've got great team speed they've got great quickness and um, uh, you know they move the ball well um, and then they have another one of those guys that's kind of an X factor in Sabandi and and uh, we'll have our you know again like I said it's a day and a half you know, so tomorrow will be, uh, you know, a film mostly and, and probably a lot of ice, ice baths for the guys and um, got to get ourselves ready for a, a big ball game against an outstanding Miami team that also puts a lot of pressure uh, out on the perimeter. We'll have to, we'll have to physically be ready um, more than anything else. Um, they're not an overly complicated team. Uh, they they just play hard um, defensively and then offensively. Uh, they, they have some guys that can uh, put the ball on the deck. They have some inside as well as some outside.